Hello children, good morning. Welcome to your English grammar class. Join your hands. Sit straight in your chairs. Don't move your hands and legs. Let's start the prayer. Saraswati Namastubhyam Varade Kama Rupini Vidyarambham Karishyami Siddhe Bhavatume Sada Saraswati Namastubhyam Varade Kama Rupini Vidyarambham Karishyami Siddhir Bhavatume Sada Good morning children. Welcome to your English grammar class. Today's date is 1st September 2021 and day is Wednesday. We are dealing with chapter 5 from English grammar. The name of the chapter is Adjectives. So before we start with the uh, exercises let uh, let me tell you let me uh, tell you about adjectives okay what are adjectives tell me quickly what are adjectives adjectives are nothing but describing words right adjectives are describing words d e s c r i b i n g describing words okay so what are describing words words which give information about a noun or a pronoun are describing words. They tell us more about a noun or a pronoun. Describing words tell us more about a noun or a pronoun. You know what are nouns? Hmm? What are nouns? Naming words are nouns. Names of place, person, places, persons, places, animals and things. So nouns are nothing but naming words. Naming words. Names of persons, places, animals and so now adjectives. The adjectives are nothing but they give information about a person, what kind of person he is, how he looks, the appearance of the person, the color of the person, the qualities of person. It gives all information about persons. It describes a person. Place. It describes a place. Size of a place. Feel of a place. Quality of a place. It tells. It describes a place. Animals. It describes color of an color of an animal, size of an animal. When you touch the animal, how you feel? It tells about animals. It even tells about the things, uh, a shape of a thing, color of a thing, size of a thing, and how many things are there, number of things. So the words which give information about words which give information or describe a person, place, animals, and things are nothing but adjectives they are called as describing words okay now let us do exercise c exercise c exercise c page number 27 page number 27 noun of your choice to each adjective given below. The first one is done for you as an example. Okay. Look here. here. Number one. Sweet. Okay. Then number two. Bright. Number six, find K I and the find. Mm. Then that's all. Only 
six are there. So what is the heading given? Add any suitable noun of your choice to each adjective given below. Okay. So each adjective given below. Already adjectives are given. Sweet, bright, heavy, tiny, happy, kind. All these are adjectives. Okay. Adjectives are what? They are describing words. They give information about a noun. Okay. So what you have to do is you need to fill up the blanks with any noun of your choice. Any suitable noun of your choice. Okay. First one is sweet dish. This is already given as an example. Sweet dish. Okay. Now see second one. Bright. Okay. Bright. It can be bright day. You can write bright. Sun is bright. Right. So this is an adjective. So let us write a noun here. Bright day. You can write bright day. Or you can write bright sun. Okay. Bright Sun. sun is bright. So bright sun. Then third is heavy. Heavy. What is heavy? Heavy is again describing word or adjectives. Okay, both means same. So heavy. Heavy bag. Heavy bucket. Heavy box. You can write anything. Okay. So I'm writing heavy box. Heavy box, you can write heavy rock. Okay, you can write heavy R O C K rock. Mm. Heavy bag, B A G bag, anything. All these are right. But you must fill up the blank with a suitable noun only. So, box, rock, bag, what are all these? All these are things, nouns, right? Fourth one is tiny. Tiny. What is the meaning of tiny? Very small. Tiny is very small. So it can be tiny insect. I N S E C T. Tiny insect. Okay. Then fifth one is happy. Happy. Happy, you can write happy girl, happy child, happy baby, happy woman. Uh, anything happy child C -H -I -L -D, child you can write girl happy girl happy boy happy woman anything anybody so child girl who are these persons right so this is again a noun kind hmm. kind is what kind is quality of a person kind person person is kind good hearted person kind person so, huh, you can write kind man, kind woman, kind lady, anything. So, kind man, I am writing man. You can write a kind woman. Okay. Kind person, anything. So, with this we have done section C. Now, come to section D. Write this quickly, children. See, you don't have to fill up with the nouns. Uh, with this same answers that I am writing. Okay, you can write answer of your choice. But that should be a noun only. Okay. Now add any suitable adjective of your choice to describe each noun given below. The first one is done for you as an example. See, now this is reverse. In this... Uh, adjective is given. Huh, no, in this noun is given. You need to fill up the blanks with adjectives. Okay. First one is dash. Okay. Number two is dash girl. Okay. Number three is dash. Five is dash bag. Number six, 
dash movie. Number seven, can you see this? Hmm. Number seven dash toes. Okay. Number eight dash fish. Now look here, Jimmy. Now add any suitable adjective of your choice to describe each noun. Okay. See, all these are nouns. Hair, hand, bag, toes. Toes, parts of from your body. Uh, then, a girl, pencil, movie, fish. What are all these? Girl, pencil, movie, fish. All these are nouns. Now let, let us add uh, suitable adjectives to these nouns. Okay. Dash, hair. It's already given short hair here. This is already given as an example. Short hair. Second one. Dash girl. You can write pretty girl, beautiful girl, happy girl, cute girl, anything. Okay. Happy girl, pretty girl, pretty. P R E T T Y pretty. Tall girl. You can write tall girl. Anything. But it must be an adjective. That's all. Then number three. Dash Ant, ant, mm. busy ant. Ant is always busy doing some of the other work. So let me write busy ant. B U S Y busy, busy ant. Then number four is dash pencil, dash pencil. Mm. Now pencil you can write long pencil, short pencil, blue pencil. You can write col a color and so long pencil. You can write short also. You can write color also. Pink pencil, blue pencil. Okay. New pencil, old pencil. Any any describing word. Okay. Dash pencil. Now put the one. Dash bag. New bag. Old bag. Mm. Costly bag. New. Heavy bag, okay. New bag. I'm writing new bag. You write any any adjective of your choice which suits the word bag. Now sixth one. Dash movie. Movie can be an interesting movie or a boring movie. Okay. Interesting. I n t e r e s t i n g. Interesting movie or movie is boring. Boring movie. So this is how you can describe a movie. Funny. Movie is funny. Hmm. Adventurous movie. But you should know the spelling. Okay. Interesting. Boring. Funny. Then seventh one. Dash. Toes. 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 Clean. Clean toes. C-L-E-A-N. Clean. You must keep your body parts clean. So, it is better you write clean toes. Next, eighth one is dash fish. Dash fish. You can write color. You can write color. Okay. Orange fish. Or you can write black fish, orange fish. Or colorful fish. Hmm? Colorful. C O L O U R color F U L full color full fish. Okay. So see in this case nouns are given. They have written suitable adjectives which describe the nouns. Okay. And here adjectives are given. They have written suitable nouns hmm? for the given adjectives. So please, you also finish these two exercises in your book, children. Exercise C and exercise D. Okay? That's all. Mm. So today you have test of pronouns. Right? Okay, children. Write your test well. Take care. Tata. Bye-bye. And finish these two exercises in your grammar book. Okay? Page number 27 and page number 28. 27 and 28.
बाय